Okay, so we've been boiling the wort for about 50 minutes, and our instructions tell us that when we've got about 10 minutes left in our boil, we're to add the last uh, Pilsner malt and then the last uh, ounce of the Cascade hop. So we'll go ahead and do that. Again, what I'd like to do is take the, the malt here and put it in some warm water before putting it inside the wort. It just makes it a little bit thinner. This stuff is really kind of thick. And, and you'll find that if you warm it up ahead of time in a hot water bath, it pours in a lot easier. So we'll go ahead and do that and then stir that in. It's not really that important to get every single ounce of this stuff out. Again, it's the, the more you get out, the better. And the intent here is just to kind of get some of the sugars out and into your wort so that your alcohol content is higher. And then again, you're adding our last bit of hops. These are nice, these are in one ounce containers, so you can just dump them in. Stir that in, and then we'll have about 10 more minutes left on our boil, and then we'll go to the very last step in uh, the fermentable process.